okay so here's a defected arctic that i bought off someone uh the driver went bad and it also damaged the diode uh, so i bought it off him and uh redid it um i put my own custom driver in it custom three mode driver uh set to 1.75 amps and uh here's a laser power meter test The heat sink is uh, still the same stock heat sink. Everything is the the same, except for the the driver. It uh, runs off of uh, two sixteen three forties, uh, three point uh, seven volts, which uh, two of them together are four point two volts together. So it's around uh, eight point four volts total. It's uh it has the four oh five slash 445 uh, G-1 lens it's pretty it's pretty uh, it's, it's a pretty stable laser I mean just like all 45s the uh, power drops off pretty quickly It's a it's a smooth drop. So peaks over two watts. Uh, what's cool about uh, the mod that I did, put it in macro. Uh, what's cool about the mod that I did was I also uh, kept, let me put it in low mode, I kept uh, the indicator LEDs working and also the, the smart switch still lights up and it uh it still works uh, within the laser uh however it's not it's not functional it doesn't actually change the modes of the laser um well it's it's just there for display so it keeps that arctic g2 look um so it's n it's not blank or you know it doesn't light up or nothing you can still go through the mode i mean through the sequence of lighting all the LEDs up and that's when the Arctic G2 would turn on uh, so now I have it wired so the power button uh, the main power button to turn the whole laser on uh, would be uh, the tail cap uh, but as soon as you even if you lightly tap this I'm gonna lightly tap it to change the mode uh, you'll see it will automatically go back down to the f the first uh, indicator light because it's not it's not uh, connected to the the smart switch in LED all all, it, all this is on a separate uh, circuit it's not actually collect, uh, connected to the, to the driver itself it's just basically power going to this um, so yeah you can see this is a uh, this is high power uh, low power pulse which is around 200 milliwatts and then uh, fast strobe which is uh, a little over uh, 1000 milliwatts so 
I wanted to make sure I keep the look of it uh, the Arctic still lighting up um, I usually just rather than keep on messing it every single time I change the mode I just usually live, leave it on uh, a single blinking light which is pretty cool so alright that's my uh, modded Arctic G2